do it. I'm sorry, sir. Stop! You're not coddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troika. Hallo dames en heren van het Roblox Game kanaal. Ik ben Jorgo, één keer Roblox Gamer en dames en heren. Vandaag ben ik weer back met een nieuwe aflevering van The Walking Dead. Um, we starten een nieuwe episode, episode 3. En het is vandaag aflevering, geen idee, volgens mij 5 of 6. En uh, ja, we gaan wel lekker een nieuwe episode starten. Dus um, ja, episode 3 zoals ik al zei. Uh, doe een blauw duimpje omhoog op even even maken. Nou, hier beneden zou ik super erg fijn vinden. Ja, ik ben nog steeds in Zaandam. En uh, ja, ik heb vandaag een dagje vrij, dus uh, ja, laten we gewoon lekker gaan beginnen. Let's go! Zoals ik al zei, episode 3, dus laten we gaan lekker beginnen. In Harm's Way. We waren de vorige, af, ja, de vorige keer door Carver gepakt. Weet je, jullie gaan het wel hier nu zien. Previously on The Walking Dead. Who do you think did this? Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? What's the most important thing in this world? Clem, it's family. People like Matthew aren't coming back. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Ah! Go to hell, you fuck. We're going home. As a family. Nou, dan was het dus gebeurd. Dus ik ben nu heel erg benieuwd. Ik sta echt met spanning uh, te wachten uh, wat in deze aflevering gaat gebeuren. Mogen we bewegen? Oké. Okay. You about done over there? Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're safer if we stick together. It's gonna be dark soon. Yeah, I know. But it's cool you came. I thought they were gonna tell my dad to go with me. Thanks. You're welcome. Everything come out all right, girls? Troy, get him tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carver out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? Where's your manners? I'm sorry. It's okay, honey. We'll chalk it up as a lesson learned, all right? Get the girls in back with the rest of them. We got a bit of a drive ahead of us. In. Nou, je hoeft ook niet zo uh, te zijn als we echt gaan wegrennen, man. We kunnen ook echt okay? veel als twee kleine meisjes. The hell did he do to you? Hey, did he hurt you? Hey, hey!
right, we gotta do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? What the hell is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. The truck's empty. First off, we're in it, so it ain't exactly empty. If you don't want to help, then just say so, okay? I'll do it myself. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Sit that. Sit down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill? Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're a man. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. You could have warned us. Yeah, you didn't tell us he was a fucking psychopath. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. Like you helped Alvin. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny, you can't reason with it. Oh shit. Jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Kenny, please, calm down. I think everyone is just tired and cranky. She's right. We should all take it down a bit. All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. That guy's a flake. I could tell the second I set eyes on him. We'll have to wait and see. It's all we can do. She's right. There's no way to know what's happened to him. I told you already. He's gone. We're close. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Hey, Clem, look at me. You trust me, right? Yeah, I'm Kenny, please, please, just, just listen to them. They know him. I... I'm scared, Kenny. Okay, hon. That's okay. That's okay. Bro, I don't know. Um... All right. Everybody ready? Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? I think so. Oh, what hit me? It's probably for the best. Oh, damn. Daar had je even een gelukpuntje bij, oké? Okay? Fresh fish. Bruh. Zijn we vissen? Zijn we het als vissen in de kooi? Gaan we dit echt doen? Gebruik ze nou ons echt gewoon als voer? Kom op. Goddamn brakes ain't working for shit. All right, up and at them. The fuck? How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now. I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, it might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. Be patient with them until it does. It oh, these men are waren met them. They're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, and they're all valid. No one needs to forgive what they did, but we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive 
Laat me even het raam dicht doen. Want het is. Look how much food they have. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. Oké. Okay. Come on, we need you for something. Can it wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. I need help. I need my dad. I, I can't. He's... He looks after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. The expansion project. He'll be back. When? I don't know. But he will come back. Thanks, Clem. And with the added manpower joining us this evening, I have no doubt that we will continue. Make sure y'all stay off the fence. Bill can see you if you're messing with it. Just to survive. It's our obligation to make this community. Oh, okay, dus niet iedereen wil hier zijn. Thanks, Barney. Yep. To provide a light. A bright light. Bright enough to shine in all this darkness. So that is what we'll do. Y'all best get some rest, because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold, but at least I'll be comfortable. Hey guys. Reggie! <gasps> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should say Reggie helped us you, but when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. Do you trust him? I don't know. He's nice, if that's what you mean. It's not. Oh. Then I don't know. They got me working outside. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Hey, Reggie. Oh, hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. All right, let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey, yeah. Uh... Hello, who are you? This freaks you out. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Mm, we don't talk about Pete. <laughs> Just don't, please. Can you guys save it for the morning? Some of us gotta be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired. But, like I said, he saved my life, so... I put up with that shit. Bill put <laughs> the work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so... I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. Why is she off by herself? Hmm? Who? Her, over there. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just like the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look. But it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? 
Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. Look, I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. That doesn't make up for what he's done, Reggie. Carver killed my friend Walter. Okay, I... I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his reasons. He killed Alvin, too. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. We won't get you in trouble. They're expecting me to keep things in line out here. Well, if Carver's such a great guy, I'm sure you've got nothing to worry about. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night, <clears throat> chat again tomorrow. I yeah. can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. After what he did to Alvin, I want him dead. <gasps> I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I think he's just scared. Everybody's scared. Ain't an excuse to sound like a nutcase. You gotta take a look around. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. But then Reggie will get in trouble. If you don't make a bunch of noise, I'm sure he'll be fine. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Yeah, I... Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep, I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking. There's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. I saw its shadow. It moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. That's when it got me. Hmm. And this place seems pretty secure. I can't either, honestly. Yeah, it's a little mini Hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? Yeah. Okay. That's over here. Soil. Dat is toch zand of zo? Looks kind of crappy. Mike had done it before. Hit a tourniquet on me real quick. Okay, okay. Hmm. Looks rickety. And wie is dat? Hey, Clem. Nick. Nick? Just thinking about Lou. Just, there's no way he's gone. That he left. How about it? Can he? Cause me, I've known him for damn near 20 years now, and I can't buy it. Of course, I can't say a thought never crossed my mind. Things change. Whole damn world change. I think you're right. He'd never leave you guys behind. Us guys, you mean? Yeah, us guys. <sighs> Guess I'll try and get some sleep. You should too. We're gonna ride our asses tomorrow for sure. Okay. Night. Okay. That look. Guess it's better than the ground. It's not. There was the measure.
Hello? Get lost. Sure. Will you please talk to me? No. Get out of here. I just Go need... away. Okay. Dus nu nog alleen het kampvuurtje dan maar, denk ik. Vuurtje bekijken. Hoe vaak wilt ze nog oplopen dat ze bij het fucking vuur is? Um, ja, we talk about the Kenny. Well, out with it. Do you see any way out of here? The fences seem pretty strong. Yeah, they do. All right. A whole house full of building supplies? I guess it ought to be. I go the fuck to sleep. I'm shooting the first one of y'all I see wandering around before sunup. Everybody get to bed. <laughs> what a dick, the gast. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? It's your decision. I'll try. You'll do just fine. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. Damn, okay. Dat was, uh, dat ga ik de aflevering afsluiten. Gewoon lekker kort aflevering. Kunnen we morgen weer knallen of uh, hoe zit het? What? Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. Oh, nee. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning. But that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now... There are some folks might be sore about what happened, and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here. Forgiveness by proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Reggie, you're nearly back in. Keep following the path and we'll welcome you back with open arms. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example I to you all. So tired. Salvation is available, but it I didn't even must be earned. Jenna will be up. taking over Reggie's well, duties you don't outside have to the be wall. Rude about it. Michael will continue on I showing his value. Nice finally... Carlos! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. S I'm sorry, sir. No, no. That ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. You discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that One I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. My... I'm not sure with my hand that I... Well, that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on! Not some mamby-pamby thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be... Overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. Go on, Carlos. 
It's my fault. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you. Unless you want one of what she's about to get, I'd pipe down, Missy. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. Stop! You're not cuddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to work. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. Damn. You're working in the armory. Follow me. Oh, the armory. Nah, but I'm gonna leave without this. Boy, Okay, well, that's fucking weird. <laughs> Who's this? <clears throat> She's one of the new people. She was with Carlos and Sarah. Uh, and... Sarah? I wish she'd stayed gone. She's had a hard time, Becca. So have we. We're not sitting on the ground like babies. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Go okay. Bonnie's waiting. Dat hoop je niet, me. Yes, we zijn in ieder geval met een aardig iemand. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. We're loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. And I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead. And I can't help but feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. At least it was mine going into it. Carver's the one who pulled the trigger. He's to blame. Yeah, but I surely didn't help matters. I thought if I was the one that found everyone, I could control it. Keep everyone safe. But that ain't how it went. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. Magnetio. Yeah, it makes a new was your first night in the yard. I know it ain't so comfortable, but it's safe. It was cold. Well, you got them skinny arms. And you ain't wearing a jacket. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, th I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. And Bill, he... He wasn't always like this. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Hello. Take the situation with the herd. That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to be somewhere comfortable for a while. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. I would Hello. if I knew where it was. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed <clears throat> and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. Yeah, a little on two men. I'm not defending what he say. did. That was. I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. I think he's crazy. He's. He's. Overstressed. It's easier to just say crazy. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads, then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? 
I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. Die ist dann. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Oh damn, a jacket. Was aardig. Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Think it might be for scan. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's cool. I like it. Well, I'm glad. Yeah. I thought it was cute, but I didn't know what you'd think. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. Follow me. Come on. Stay in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. Hey. You want a hug? Okay, well, I owe you one for later then. You might not know what's coming, though, but I could just sneak up on you when you're not expecting it. My dad's never hit me before. Even when I was really bad. <laughs> he never hit me. He didn't want to do it, Sarah. Carver made him. He's the bad guy, not your dad. So, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess so. Carver hit me super hard, because it still hurts like crazy. Yeah, <laughs> it looked like it. Well, thanks for trying to help. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep, no problem, Tavia. Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Pick up a pair of those shears. Okay. Okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just pick them, put them in the basket. Simple. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Got it? Hey, so, is she gonna be okay? Cause what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. I'll take care of her. You don't have to worry. Good, good. Cause I'm awful at that stuff. Look, Bill's had it out for me ever since I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. That was awkward. I won't do that again. I'm gonna go work now. Oké, okay, dat was dus een. Uh, ja, ik uh, denk dat is genoeg. Um, ja, ik, ik, ik zei, ja, weet je, I don't know. Ik, ik weet niet wat hier gaat gebeuren. Ik weet niet als we hier nog ooit uitkomen of... Ja, ik denk dat Luke wel ons gaat helpen. Ik heb zo'n gevoel van wel. Ik weet niet wanneer, ik weet niet hoe, ik weet niet wat. Misschien komt hij wel met een grote groep, maar... Ja, ehm... Um... Voor de rest, deze. En dames en heren, ik wil jullie van harte bedanken voor het kijken naar deze video. Uh, ik hoop dat jullie het leuk vonden. Doe dat blauw duimpje omhoog. Maar leuk even te maken naar hier beneden. Volgende aflevering zijn we weer terug. Uh, met uh, ja, het vervolg. En uh, ja, dat zie ik wel aan. Bedankt voor het kijken en tot de volgende keer. Tjallas.